Hi, it's a day's review. It's been a while. <coughs> I've not done one for about a year. Um, but just when I got this, it fired up my interest again. For, uh, you know, doing a quick review. Not in depth or anything. Just a quick what I think of it and how it looks. So, I hope you enjoy it. This is what the front of the box looks like. I won't bore you with showing the sides and everything and the inside. Leave things as a bit of a surprise for if you if you decide to get it, you know, rather than showing you every tiny thing. But that's the front. And then for the main event, there he is. Now, in my opinion, the head, head sculpt on this is even better than what they showed on the uh, previews. I just think it looks a lot better than what they were saying he was going to get. Uh, absolutely beautiful. Terrific paintwork as usual. Um, just the hair and everything is just... I mean probably on camera it doesn't do it as much justice. Um, beautiful cloak. Don't know what kind of material it is. But it's just absolutely gorgeous. Leather effect belt and tiny little hook there for his lightsaber. Articulation is pretty good, as you'd expect. A detailed hands, you get a few different hands. And the boots, very good. A nice thin material. Hang on a minute. Nice thin material that looks like leather so you can move it a fair bit and it doesn't you know restrict it too much well yeah nice um, probably won't stand up now um, so he has a tiny lightsaber you get two of these, one that you can put the lightsaber end on. We've got a little eyelet on, which you can just hook into there. Uh, then you've got the other one that has the lightsaber out on it, which is identical, apart from this one's got a hole that goes in a bit more, so you can put that in. Why they didn't just give you that one, I don't know. But I suppose you got a spare. But yeah, very nice. And another good feature with this is the extra arm you get. So you unplug his arm from just above the elbow, plug this one in, and then it might not show up here. You can probably barely see it actually. Let's get a bit of shade on it if I can. That's a bit better. It does have a really nice light up effect. So yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. Not bad at all, and it, it glows really well right to the end. Oops, quite <laughs> Um, also, the three little batteries that go in there, you get them included, and a little on-off switch there. So yeah, that's, uh, yeah, I wouldn't over-rotate that, just in case the wires come out, whatever it's, however it's done. Uh, but yeah, that's nice. Uh, you get the same sort of base as all the Star Wars figures you're getting now. Which is good, that's nice. Even a little bit chunky. You do take up a lot of room these things, but it's not bad. I not even took it out of the packaging yet because I've only just got it. But yeah, all in all, very pleased. He does look a bit daft with his hood up at the moment. So it's a bit too pointy. 
but you can be always uh, be able to manipulate that however you want. Over time it'll flop a bit more. But a nice weathered effect robe as well. You know, all rough edges on it. But yeah, very pleased. So, like I say, just a quick one, not too long, won't bore you with everything, just let you know it is good. Bye.